Kristallnacht was known as the Night of Broken Glass or the November pro Pogrom. It was a series of attacks against Jews throughout Nazi Germany and parts of Austria. On November 9th and 10th, 1938, thousands of Jewish homes and Jewish-owned businesses and synagogues were ransacked and destroyed by Nazi party officials, members of the SA stormtroopers, and Hitler Youth. 900 synagogues were desecrated or set on fire, many of them burning throughout the night in full view of local firefighters who received orders to intervene only to prevent flames from spreading to nearby German-owned buildings. That night, 91 Jews were killed, 30,000 men, a quarter of all the Jewish men living in Germany, were taken to concentration camps. The real significance of Kristallnacht was that it marked a huge escalation of Nazi anti-Semitism. It was the first time that large numbers of Jews were subjected to widespread physical violence and murdered in Nazi Germany simply because they were Jews. It was the time that, at the time, it was the most documented event and the German people and the rest of the world remain silent. It also demonstrated that the Nazis were prepared to use violence to back up their propaganda that had been going on for years, ultimately resulting in Hitler's final solution. This year marks the 75th anniversary of Kristallnacht. Because of the importance of this anniversary, the Holocaust Center reached out to several local organizations asking them to be part of a community-wide remembrance. We wanted to start a dialogue about building a more respectful and engaged Central Florida community where bystanders are encouraged and inspired to be upstanders. This led to an extraordinary community collaboration between the Interfaith Council, the Bach Festival Society, and the Negro Spiritual Scholarship Foundation. Shortly after more partners came on board, such as the Winter Park Institute, the Enzion Theater, Global Peace Film Festival, the Cornell Fine Arts Museum, Orange County Library System, and the cities of Orlando, Winter Park, and Maitland. A series of programs and events have been planned, a full schedule of which is available at crystalnock2013.org. I hope that you will join us at the Holocaust Center for one of our many programs.